Assalamualaikum and hi, my name is Nur Adila Binti Rosli and right now I'm going to use a poster that I've created by myself to present and to show all of you about my content. Okay, the topic that I want to stress today is about hidden hunger. Hidden hunger is related to the SDG goal 2 which is aims to end hunger, achieve food security, improve nutrition and promote sustainable agriculture by 2030. The triple burden of malnutrition, which is the undernutrition, hidden hunger and overweight, threaten the survival, growth and development of children and young people. So, what is actually hidden hunger? Hidden hunger is a nutritional problem caused by both undernutrition and overnutrition. You can feel full or intake excessive energy. However, you still may not have intake the essential nutrient to keep the body functioning. So, this form of hunger is often ignored or overshadowed by hunger related to energy deficits. Therefore, according to Food and Agriculture Organization of United Nations, which is the FAO, currently 10% of world population or nearly 795 million people are undernourished. Undernourished of what? So here are the five common micronutrient deficiency includes uh, vitamin A, iron, folate, iodine, and zinc. This kind of deficiency can affect, uh, give effect of uh, cognitive impairment, vision problem, weak immune system, fatigue uh, weakness, maternal and infant mortality, reproductive problem, and also stunted growth. So imagine if this happens to our children, you think that what gonna happen to our world ahead? So, risk for hidden hunger can be eliminated through a well-balanced diet with variety of food rich in micronutrient. Therefore, the solution to this problem is that we need to eat food properly. Be aware of the nutrient in our food. Do not overdose it and take it as per recommended. So, uh, to, so for reflection, first and foremost, I'd like to thank uh, my lecturer, Professor Madia Dr. Fatima Binti Muhammad for assisting me in completing this task. The experience of making this project has taught me a lot. I learned that in terms of hunger, it's not only physical, which is people got no food to eat and starving to death, but it also means deficiency in terms of certain micronutrients such as vitamin A, folate, zinc, and so on. And it's actually shocking as one in three people around the world actually facing this problem and surely it affects a lot especially for uh, vulnerable people such as pregnant moms and children as i starting to explore more about this kind of new hunger this assignment becomes more enjoyable for me so hopefully all the knowledge that i've gained while completing the assignment can help people to recognize their needs in food and practice a healthy diet more that's all from me thank you